Yep. You guessed it. Four. And yes, it's accelerated. Slightly hexed. Anyway, welcome to Ponery's Kicking It Old School, the season finale, episode 24. We made it, folks. I think. I think we made it just before New Year's, so if you did if we did, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. So, let's begin a new quest, because I don't know what quest is on that list. Log three. And we'll call ourselves Honory, of course. And mail fast. What I love about this game, this particular game does things in chapters and it actually bounces around between characters, which I love that. This is a story about royal soldiers of a small country called Berland. One of the royal soldiers is you, Ragnar. One morning, the king summons all the soldiers to the castle court. The king will speak to you. Listen carefully. Everyone, at ease. You must have heard the rumor that children have been vanishing recently. The mothers from Izumit village came to me in tears this morning, begging for help. As the king of this country, I cannot ignore this problem any longer. Find the cause of these disappearances and report to me. Oh, soldier, please find our children. They're alive, I know it. Very well. My dogs are going nuts. So let's speak to the king. I'm counting on your good work, Ragnar. Very well. Where are you going? Let's go slow, Ragnar. Let's go slow. I think my folks like my dogs being chaotic like this. They must. They allow it. Monsters have been around for some time, and they may be the cause of the recent disappearances of children. Is that right? Very well. Hey, Ragnar, still here? Haven't the, haven't the others already left for Izumit Village? I suppose. I hear that monsters which only appear at night are now appearing during the day. Troubled times, aren't they? Oh, soldier, please find our children. Wait a minute. Oh, she ran all the way back here. All right, whatever. Let's just go. Castle doors are open. As splendid castle as always. I wish to be a royal soldier. Say, can you take me along? Uh, sure. Really? I shall follow you then. He's very slow. Let's just see if he follows me in. Nope, he won't. I'm supposed to speak to a guy in the jail, I think. Maybe? Maybe it's up here? I would imagine it's actually downstairs. This reminds me of the Final Fantasy Castle, where this little exit here went to nowhere. <laughs> it's like, what was the point of that? Literally no point to that. Can't go that way. Wow. Oh, well, they almost got quiet. Alright, we're out of here. Move it. Clearly he's not following us. I only have 50 gold. Let's take a medical herb. Notice I have infinite gold. Berlin's king is good natured and keeps taxes low. Unfortunately, he can't spend much on your equipment. Accumulate gold and buy more powerful weapons and armor. Be sure to equip them. Yes, thank you. 
What do you got? Oh, we're gonna need a lot of money. Yeah, I have to earn the I have to earn the the initial money. How's our equipment anyway? Okay, we got something on us. So let's. Uh, can I talk to signs? Yeah. Report to the sighting of suspicious people. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk around a little bit, and we have to level up a bit. I swear, I did something for my experience. Could be wrong. Tell you what, let me double check that real quick and try to get these dogs under control. We'll be right back. A few moments later. Okay, we're back, and as you can see, I found a way to get my guy leveled up, because it's one of those things I have to do off-screen, so he will be leveling at a normal rate now, but I figured out how to do it earlier, and I met Florida, whose husband Alex hasn't returned from his last trip. She says, tell me if I see him. The thing about this game that's different than the other ones is the pathing of each NPC is specific. See how she paces back and forth? She doesn't deviate from this path. That's what she does. <laughs> you may find out something at Ismet Village. Ooh, foreshadowing. Armor shop. I would like to buy some armor, yes. I would like to buy some chain mail. And I would like to buy a scale shield. And I would like to buy a wooden hat. I'd like to sell my leather armor. Sure. No. Oh, no, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. So the weapon shop and the armor shop are two separate places now. Chain mail, scale shield, wooden hat. There, now we got a bit more defense, too. What's this guy gonna tell me? Ragnar, did you know? Some doors aren't locked. They open without a key. Is that right? That's good to know. Because now we have door instead of item, key, use, all that good stuff. So anyway, we gathered some info. We need to go find Ismet Village. Because we were told that that is somewhere else. And we're going to put some serious hurting on these guys, as you can see. Oh, I also think I set it up to where I'm always doing epic hits. <laughs> I may turn that off. It's a bit annoying. Always doing an epic hit. I mean, it'll get us through the battles really quick, though, won't it? Like that. And like that. 246 damage. <laughs> We're doing this for story, damn it. Alright, let's do this here, cave. Nobody there. Uh huh. He actually hit me. Yeah, I think by my next episode, I'm gonna turn off the uh, the terrific blow thing. I mean, I can already level them out like crazy. I'm not gonna make them hit, like, stupidly hard every time. Although it does make the battles faster, I have to admit. Alright, let's search. Yeah. Medical herb. Alright. Take it. Not that they're ever gonna hit us. Can I run? Yeah. Let's just not waste our time. Hey, there's a guy there. This, this dude is slow. Like, that guy's really slow. He's like, slowly, slowly, Ragnar, slowly. I don't want to go slow. I'm in a hurry. we got things to do. I'm on my way to Im Ismet Village, too. That's great. I think that was gold. Run. He's going to come up from that way. <clears throat> okay. So... Ismet Village should be... Right there. Right? Let's read the sign. 
It's the wrong side. You can't read the message. That's actually clever. Do not play in the woods. What if I want to play in the woods? Welcome to Ismet Village. Uh, thank you? Ah. I am a traveling prophetess. I can see the future. A chosen one will soon appear somewhere in this world. Alright. <clears throat> can I search these? Yeah, see, that's the other neat thing about this one. This was the first game where you can actually search inside things. Like that. Found a medical herb. Nothing in there. Just somebody's underwear. Hey, there's a cat. Mew. What's up, dude? My wife says Pocos was playing with something funny, with some funny shoes when he vanished. Are you Pocos? Did you leave something funny? I don't think so. It's too early for those kinds of secrets, I'd imagine. But you're the innkeeper. You are an item shop. You know what? I'll take one. Sure. Let me sell one of my medical herbs, because I really don't think you're going to be able to hit me anyway. Sure. Nope. Soldier, please find my child. He vanishes. He vanished like smoke before my very eyes. He's wearing shoes of some sort. I guess the bookcases don't count. Pan. This is a school. That's great. No way. Wait, stop! <laughs> Welcome, soldier. I'm teaching now. Perhaps we can talk at night. Sure. You're a soldier. That's great. I'll be a royal soldier someday. Yeah, you should have higher ambition. The missing child, Pocus of the Inn, he flew away into the sky. Don't interrupt. I'm studying. Yeah, okay. Oh, you made it. Hey, Ragnar. It's you. You came to this village, too. The tower west of here looks suspicious. I wonder how we can get in. I don't know. Hey, look. First time they actually animate things on screen. On the regular, that is. A little late in the day for you to be wearing a robe, isn't it? The man in jail stole some bread. Seems he lost his memory. He acts like a child. He must have been through some ordeal. Alright. Guess we gotta go find the jail. Uh, do you have better stuff? Oh, you do. Well, in that case, go ahead and give me half plate armor and the iron shield. Oh. Yeah, okay. Fan. You can have my chain mail. Sure. And you can have my scale shield. Sure. Now you can sell me an iron shield. Nope. Uh, no, we're done. We're good. We're good. No, we're good, dude. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Half plate armor, iron shield, wooden hat. What do you got for weapons? Let's see. Iron spear sounds good. Yeah. Uh, you can have my chain sickle. Sure. Nope. Uh, equip. Iron spear. Okay, everything else is good to go. Let's go check out this here jail. Yep, there's a guy here. Get me out, sir. I was hungry and took some bread. That's all I did, sob. I can't get this door, right? There's no key. What's his name? Doesn't say. Right. I don't think they told me who the guy's name is in the jail, did they? They just said there's a guy in the jail. Wait, why would this be like this? Nothing there. Alright, who told me there was a dude in the jail? This chick, right? Yeah. 
Alright, so there's a guy in the jail. He stole some bread. We don't know his name. No one's telling me his name. Yeah, no one's telling me his name. Now, I think what I'm supposed to do at this point is... Go back to Berlin. I think I'm supposed to go back to Berlin. Oh, it's nighttime. That's right. I gotta go talk to the teacher at nighttime. You actually hit me! Now it's nighttime, so the dialogues will change. Wow, you're moving a lot quicker at night. Come here. Can kids really van vanish before your eyes? It's impossible. What's this kid doing all by himself? They say the man in the underground jail is named Alex. He's my pal. Okay. Now we know his name. We were just talking about the incidents. I believe the children know something. Don't worry, Principal. Children always have secrets. Uh-huh. The first secret was... That there was a kid, that there was a, uh, there's a guy in the jail named Alex. That's the first thing. Alright, move, little, you little. Our son vanished too. Who's done this? What do they want? I don't know, but I'll have to find them, I suspect, because that's what heroes do. See if there's anybody else I can talk to. Oh, there's a guy over there. I'm a traveler. I'm going to go take a bath. Please leave. Uh, no. Hey, baby. <laughs> Don't you get out of that nunwear? <laughs> Let me help you out of that nunwear. What? I'm not snooping. Keep quiet. I'll tell you something. I saw the man in the underground jail before. In the castle town of Berlin, maybe. Why don't you go back there? Yeah, maybe I will. Maybe I will. Run. <clears throat> Wait, is this guy heading back now? I'm in trouble. I'm lost. I think their soldiers are all just looking the same. <laughs> no honor amongst among monsters. He was like, F no, I'm out of here. Well, at least it's not every step. It's like every three steps. Yeah, this cave is severe. Thank you. Alright, where was the castle? I think it's this way. This house is waiting for her missing husband to return. How sad. Oh. What are you doing here? How long will she wait? She, she should give up hope and marry me. You need to be murdered. What? Alex is in Ismet Village? Caught stealing? Take me there, please. Oh, she's following me. <laughs> Look at that. That guy wants you to marry him. I got you to follow me out of town. Ah, <laughs> baby. Look at that, she's following me. She won't attack though. Fan, whatever. <clears throat> so I'm actually partied with an NPC. Or I just got one in tow, basically. I could just run. There's no point in fighting these things when you're level 52, 54. Yeah. Hey, right, come on. Oh, chill with the freaking fights already. There we go. Ismit's over this way, yeah? Yeah. 
Alright, let me take you over to the jail so you can start murdering the townspeople. It's you, isn't it? Who are you, ma'am? You don't recognize me? I'm Flora, your wife. Don't you even remember this? Whack! <laughs> Flora? Yes, it's me! What must have come over me? I must have lost my mind in fear after being attacked by monsters. Soldier, thanks for finding me. I remember hearing this from some children. The secret playground is four steps to the south and then four steps to the east of the signpost. Something may be there. You better check it out. Be careful. Are you gonna stay here? Ah, uh, they just repeat it. Are y'all still in here? Oh yeah, because you're not actually being let out of jail yet. <laughs> Alright, so. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Come this way. Ah, we're in the well. Give him hell, come this way. Give him hell, Ragnar. If you go that way, you'll go back. Oh, that's the exit. Come this way. Not that way. <laughs> I kind of like that. Uh, well, what if I want to go that way? Not that way. Okay. That's pretty funny. Come this way. I guess that means this way. Every time they say it, it's basically go in the opposite direction that you're headed. Uh, that way? Not that way. We're so obedient. Oh, this box is talking to me. Flying shoes. But Ragnar can't carry any more things. Do I want to discard something? Yes. Uh, we'll drop a medical herb. Okay. Can I wear them? Oh. <laughs> I bumped into the ceiling. Derp. Okay. <laughs> the guy you were trying to heal is no longer there. Wait a minute. I'm looking for somebody, I think. Oh, hello. I'm Healy. I'm a healer, but I dream of becoming human. If I make friends with humans, perhaps I'll become one. Take me along. Sure. Hooray, thanks. Healy joined the party. Okay. Come with me, little dude. Well... Now we gotta go look for stuff and things. Clearly. Oh, I should attack things and see if Healy can actually gain levels. Guess we'll find out. If I do enough fights, maybe I'll find out.
That seemed like... Yeah, okay. One of these ways is going to take us to that box. Should be this way. I need to know what's in there. Six hundred gold. Okay. Fan. Pretty sure we just hit every point on this map, so we can leave now. Wow, Healy's magic just went up to 257. He's not even leveling, though, so I don't understand what's going on with that. Eh, whatever. So we do. Alright, let's head out of here. Let's see if there's any other stuff and things. Yeah, now he's got 338 MP. Wow, I wonder how much MP he actually gets. Oh. oh, that's right, I got that one MP per step buff. That's what it is. Hex. That's what that is. Hey, stuff and things. No. Wait a minute, why can't I give you... Okay, so Healy can't actually um, carry things. Lame. If you go that way, you'll go... Yeah, that's what we want to do. There we go. Whoa, where's this? Agility seed! Yes. Uh, we will drop this. And then we will use that. <laughs> Super hacks. out of here. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see. Once we do that... I guess we have to try to go to that tower. I can't think of anywhere else to go. That's so funny that Kiwi's actually fighting, even though I can't give him any weapons. Let's see if I can use the shoes this time. There we go. Oh, look. Come this way, you brat. Let me go. I don't want to go. Right. Okay. Healy's attacking. What are you doing here? Oh, Ragnar, I found the old well by chance and came this far. The monsters in this town or tower are very tough. You don't say. Hmm. 
I should have let Healy, whom I met in the well, join me. I envy you. <laughs> yeah. No, we're gonna run. Because Healy doesn't level. And I don't need to anymore. Here we go. What you got? What's it? What do we have here? Gold. Stuff and things, just what I need. Scale shield. Nope. I like how it leaves it behind so you don't lose it. That's pretty nice. Alright, so. Doesn't that just sound like something that's cursed? Like... Like... Eh? Wow! It's not cursed! Imagine that! Okay! That's cool! Let's go see if there's any stuff... Any more stuff in day, more stuff in things. guess I won't be needing this anymore. And now I need to eat this. Alright. Uh, so I guess we have to go this way now. Man. <laughs> animating. What was that? Oh, that actually... If I remember right, that restores Healy's MP. But if you notice, it dropped back down to 40 when I stepped on it. So now we gotta start all over and get that back all the way up to like 600 or whatever he had. Uh... I don't think we're supposed to go that way. dare you. Oh, what happened to you? What happened to you, bro? Ragnar, I'm nearing my end. Listen well. Somewhere in this world, the ruler of evil is about to resurrect. Also, according to a prophecy, the hero who shall defeat him is now growing up. The evil ones intend to destroy the hero while he or she is still growing, while he or she is growing and still weak. Save all children. Okay. His name is Ragnar, not Michael Jackson. Help! Help me! Help me, sir! They say I'm the hero and treat me badly! Who are you? I have no business with a lowly royal soldier. Okay. You fool, as you wish, I'll smash you to bits. Sorrow's shadow. You know what? I'll just attack you first. Easy mode. I 
can't believe I lost. My hacks were stronger than yours. I'm sure other monsters will seek out and destroy the hero. All mankind will eventually be offered up to the ruler of evil. Hooray! Thank you, sir! We can go home, right? I heard you can go home if you jump somewhere. What do you say? Whatever. Oh, probably off the top of the tower. Right. Okay. Are you still... Yep, he's dead. And he remembers his comrade's words. Well, that's cool. The playback. Alright. Wait a minute. Do I not have the shoes anymore? I do have the shoes. I should just be able to go here and then do this. Right? Nope. What if I do this? Haha. <laughs> X. Okay, here we go. Ah, it's Mother! Hooray! Okay. How can you ever thank me, you say? Hmm. Take the children back to Ismet. Yeah, I did this. Okay, well, as long as everyone's happy, I guess. And the mother who begged you to save my child at Berlin Castle. Uh, you're welcome. Alright, well, let's head back to Berlin Castle then, see what, see what we're doing next. What? You already saved the children? Yay! <laughs> or, if you do the, uh... What is it? CSI Miami? Yeah! <laughs> that. Alright, we're back at the castle. Now, who should I go speak to? Because apparently... Let's go back to the king. Wait. Ragnar, good work. Say, will you let me take credit for saving the children? No. I was only kidding. You're so naive. Right. Oh, look at that. Ragnar, welcome back. I'm truly impressed with your accomplishment. I'm proud of having a soldier like you. I will give you a reward. Name anything you want. What? You want to go on a journey? You intend to find and protect the hero who is still a child. I see. You have my full support. Ragnar, this is a gift from... A farewell gift from me. Take it. We have plenty of experience, but thanks anyway. Did you notice how low his intelligence was? He's kind of dumb. Have a safe journey. Right. Thus Ragnar left on a journey in search of a hero. And that was the end of chapter one. And I think what I'll probably do... Should I end the episode here? Or shall we move forward? What do you think we should do? I think we should go forward. Why not? It's early enough. Yeah. The story up to this point will be saved in the Imperial Scrolls of Honor. Is that alright? Of course. Princess Elena's Adventure. Somewhere, long ago, there was a very tomboyish princess named Elena. The king was constantly upset by her behavior one morning... He summoned the princess to his chamber. Princess, Princess Elena, your father wants to see you. Elena, your tutor informed me that you're planning a journey to test your strength. I forbid it. You're the princess of this country. I won't allow you to go venture into the outside world where monsters lurk. Never go outside of this castle. Is that clear? That's all. You can kiss my ass. Yes. Never! Why are you so reckless? Because I can be. The king only says these things because he's concerned about you. Please understand. Princess, why are you such a tomboy? Your late mother would be s was so refined. As your tutor, I feel responsible for how you've turned out. Maybe she just doesn't like doing girly things. Santine Castle, that's where we are. Please return to your chamber. I don't want to. Ah, Princess, you look well. Not really. There's no key. Well, that kind of sucks. Who are you? Christo. 
Princess Elena, your tutor, Bray, told me you plan to go out alone. That's so reckless. If something happens to you, I... I mean, the king will be devastated. Uh, huh? Got a thing for that girl, do you? Let's see what's in here. Nothing. Not even socks? Fairy water. Okay, fine. Nothing special. Right. I'm so hungry. When will the food be ready? Mm, let's find out. I must cook meals. I'm so busy. Right. Uh, you just did. He's a nice man, but he has a big mouth. Clearly. Should I have him executed for insolence? That seems about the right thing to do. Well, I guess we can't do anything on this particular floor. Ah, here's my... Chambers of the King and the Princess are upstairs. Good, because I kind of need to be set free, right? I requested that the wall in the Princess's chamber be fixed. Don't ever kick the wall again, please. Foreshadowing. It's time for you to leave. Actually, let me check all this stuff. Nothing. Feather hat. Nothing. 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 No, I can't. You need to leave. Right meow. I'm the key to that. You need to go, dude. Like, piece off. Hmm. Well, I have to wait for him, I guess. So, who do I go talk to now while I'm waiting for this guy to disappear? I think we already went and talked to everybody. Yeah, we already talked to everybody. Like, they don't want to talk to me, and I guess I can talk to this guy. If the princess leaves the castle, she may fall into evil hands. Is that right? Alright, that's your tutor. That's just some advisory jerk-off. Go away, dude. What the hell? Okay. Let's go ahead and equip stuff while we're sitting here. There. He won't go away. I already talked to that guy. I already talked to that guy. I already talked to this guy. I'm supposed to talk to everybody. And then they let me go? No. By the king's order, I cannot let you pass. I already talked to that guy. Please return to your chamber. Please kiss my ass. Right. Okay. Gotta just do this and kill some time. I already talked to those guys. Are you done making food? No. Are you done whining about no food? Yeah. Can't talk to that guy because he's in like this golden chamber nonsense. How about now? He's gone. Yes, of course. And here we go. Talk to my cat. Mew. Just looking around before we leave in case there's, you know, stuff and things. Guess there aren't any. There we go. Can I go in here? No key. We're out. Oh, there they are. Bray. Princess, it's reckless to journey alone. If you're determined, I'll accompany you. I, your humble, humble servant, will accompany you also, Princess. Let's go now. So I have... Extras. Great. Now, I'm going to take a pause, and I'm going to hex these characters so we can get through the next chapter with ease. Sit tight. I'll be right back. Two days later. Well, it's been a couple of days because, for some reason, I thought I had recorded 
where I last left you to the point where I'm at now. So, you may have noticed that this episode came out a day late. So, Happy New Year! Because I forgot. Uh, something in my life has been really messing with me, and it's thrown me into disarray, so I'm trying to sort through that, and then I forgot that I forgot to record the last part of the episode. But anyway, here we are. Um, this is actually the bazaar, which is about two steps ahead of where I left you last. I'll just try to paraphrase what had happened. I did the the hacks and I leveled up the characters so they were more uh, see they were easier to work with to get through the story and we ended up going north and east to the town of Tempe where people were being systematically executed or kidnapped and executed or something to that effect so we had to find out who was responsible and take them out and then we went to I believe the town of Fraynor I think it's the town of Fraynor, and from there we found a imposter of you, and they were just farting around, and we ended up here. So basically, what we do is we made a big circle. We left Santim north and east, Tempe went further east, Fraynor uh, solved the problems there, which involved uh, paying a bribe, and then we ended up here at the Desert Bazaar. Anyway, I don't want to bore you too much with it, but I've already done the equipment part of this. So right now, I'm actually looking for an NPC that is going to tell me about my papa. Alright, she says there's something here. Nothing. Nothing. I might have looted this already. Let's go talk to this here horse. Of course. Ah, there we go. I've been looking for you. Return to the castle immediately. The king is in trouble. Uh, yeah, I'll get to it when I get to it. Alright, so there's nothing here I really need. But before we leave, I want to talk to everybody. Alright, so this is a this is a kitchen of some sort. Here we go to Endor, watch the tournament. Right. Okay, so they're telling us that there's a shrine east of here that leads to Endor. What do you got? Yeah, I did all this already. Okay, so the easiest way to get back home is we simply just use Bray's return spell. And there we are. Let's go see our fava. Oh, I'm glad you're back safely. Good. Get out of the way. Let's go see what und papa wants. It's awful. The king can't speak. How oh, terrible. He can't speak. This must be kept a secret. But if he remains like this, yes, I know. Gaz, the old man who lives in the backyard shed, may know a remedy. Alright. Let's go see Gaz. I have to jump over the side. <clears throat> yeah, pretty sure that's how this works. Let's see what he's going to tell us. King lost his voice. I know Marone, the poet, damaged his throat once. Now he has the loveliest voice in the court. He may know what to do. Okay, so now I'm looking for... Singer. It's probably not you.
not you. need to go serene. What? No. We're not doing that. Oh, can't do that either. Okay. That's annoying. So I've got to go the whole roundabout way just to leave the castle every single time. Annoyed. Wait a minute, why am I carrying chainmail? Did I just forget to equip it? Yeah, that's what it is. Wait, I better check everyone else then. No, they're good. Okay, now we go out here, and then we go over here. And we get into our first fight of the, this segment. Too easy. Okay, I am looking for... That guy up there. Almost guaranteed. I'm Marone. Why is my voice so lovely? I think taking birdsong nectar and elfin medicine helped. I found it in the desert bazaar during a trip. Wait. Oh, no, go back up here. So, we're going to do the back and forth thing. Right. Thankfully, I don't have to really do it. Okay. So I have to go back to the Desert Bazaar. There's a person that's gonna sell me birdsong nectar, does that sound about right? I can't do that, they're already empty. I think I emptied them. I bought too many things, they're so heavy. Birdsong nectar? This shop once had some. You might get some in the Western Tower, where they say elves visit. Sure... Okay, let's go look! What's up, dude? Hey! Huh. Looks like my dogs will... bark even on my day off. Great. Here, come here! Oh my god. to me. The door is locked. I can't go upstairs. Right. Okay, there's an inn here in the basement, if you so need it. Eh, maybe I'll take a nap. I used a bit of MP. There we go. Alright, so... Grizzly sabers are cool, but they're no singing sword from uh, Who Framed Roger Rabbit. I don't. Th I think I can go that way. So we gotta go back down here. Jesus. Oh, cool. Bewildered. Bewilders guarantee you can run. Let's go. Avoid 
avoid some of the basic fights. Let's see if my thieves key will work here. Yes. Yeah, we should fight some of them. Accelerated game also means accelerated spawns, apparently. Uh, let's see. Alright. Oh, we can't allow that. There's got to be a way in here somewhere. Probably over here. There it is. Ooh, stuff and things. Okay. I'm going to give this to Bray. I always try to spread the wealth terms of uh, stats, because you're only strong as your weakest link, right? Ooh. <laughs> I think that's part of the hack, because I got 131 points from that. <laughs> <coughs> Alright. Backtrack a little ways. I'm just curious what he hits for now. Well, I guess we'll have to wait until we find a fight where you can do it. hacks, but it ain't like uber hacks. Just a sec. My allergies to kick in the new year have been absolutely diabolical. Whew. Elena's pretty tough. She may be Xeno Warrior Princess for all we know. think about which one they were going to let go first. Copper sword. Nope. Alright. elves up here. Eek, you're humans! Lita, we're leaving now! Yes, sister. Oops, I dropped the medicine. Don't worry about it, hurry! Birdsong Nectar. I wonder if they dropped more than one. Nope. There shouldn't be monsters up here. Let's see if I can just cast Return. That would be great. Yes. Oh. Yeah, that should be okay. Right? Let's find out.
There we go. Uh, 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 oh, I, I can speak! I can speak! You did! I thank you. I had terrible dreams. A big monster came out of the evil world and was destroying everything. At first I intended to keep them to myself, but I kept having the same dreams over and over again. I became worried, so I decided to tell the council about them, and then I lost my voice. Something terrible may be about to happen. I won't stop you anymore. Travel the world and see what's happening. Brain Christo, I place Elena's safety in your hands. Hmm. So now we have to be very careful on our journey. But unfortunately, our journey here has come to an end. Because this was the season finale of Ponery's Kickin' It Old School, Season 2. And as I previously stated, now that you know what game we're playing, I think I will defer the break that I take for months on end. And so I will tell you that Season 3 will be right around the corner. I don't have anything better to do anyway. So anyway, if you're new to my channel, welcome. But if you're a regular here, welcome back. Either way, maybe check out my other playlists and see if my other interests may be of interest to you. Obviously, the season premiere of Season 3 will be this. So, until I see you next time, hopefully you enjoyed the series, and we'll see you for Season 3. Later.